Okay, so quick tip on AFK. You can set up your champions and build your items before taking AFK. So I could, yeah. You can't sell though, so I can't like sell this vein. I'm trying to press E over them, doesn't work. But you can build Jeweled Gauntlet. Maybe kill one more unit and then take AFK. Uh, okay, now I can text. A few minutes later. Um, we want some AP here, so I guess I could go for Negatron. Or sorry, Rod. Yeah, just Rod again. But I like Ionic Spark a lot. I feel like if you don't run Mordekaiser, it's just a great way to reduce magic resistance, right? Like, that's what it's for, right? Zoe again. Well, you do have the two star blocks. I could just do this. And then I want some sort of front line, which I don't have right now. This gives me Brawler. We could chill like this. I'll probably continue loose streaking. I don't need this vein. Don't really need Nasus. The mascot isn't useless because I could play with um what are they called? Yumi. Yumi's a spell slinger. And mascot. Not spell slinger. She's a star guardian and uh, sp mascot. I did not kill a single unit, so that sucks. I'm gonna be at 50 health this game. Hmm. Which is fine. I mean, we took AFK, right? We kind of don't really kill too many units when we take it. Ooh. Can we do a reroll? Imagine if you set up underground during AFK. Oh my god. I'm down to just reroll Lux though. Instead of setting up underground now. Wow, that would be really good. AFK plus underground. That would have been a tuber. Instead, we'll wait. Oh, why is this guy going for Lux as well? Like, let me check how many Luxes are out of the pool. Like, I get having a two-star Lux, but then why does he have an extra one on his bench right there? Seems a little bad-mannered, you know? Yeah, Lux kind of sucks. It doesn't do that much damage, and it takes a long time for her to cast. I should have kept the Underground. And she targets randomly, so the Lux she damaged here ended up not mattering at all. So, okay, it's just never reroll Lux. Oh my god. Burn away the shadow. <sighs> if she did a third more damage, it would not have changed the fight at all. So even if I had three star luck, she still sucks. I'll try it for science. Don't do this at home. Because it is really bad. A in oh my god. Maybe I could do like civilian star guardian stuff. I just have so many of her, and I have so much gold, and I have great items, so it's like... If this isn't the time to do it, when is? Probably if you get Lux Augment. Never mind, that's the actual time to do it. Oh my god, beautiful items, man. Uh, why, am I, why do I do this to myself? Why do I do this to myself, man? Need like one more spell sling. Okay, one more star guardian. Do this. Angels. And then I'd probably want to ionic someone. I want to start winning. I'll throw it on Annie for now. And we should be good to go from here. Don't need you, don't need you. I'll hold on to these guys. And I could play this guy. See, see what I mean? Like, this Lux is so bad. Like, I barely won that fight when I'm three star, two items. 
It's so bad. Two synergies active for her. Mascot heart, I'm down. Mainly because it gives me a Yumi. Healing, is that useful? It's a little useful. I'll do the Yumi for now. Don't pick it up yet. Okay, so we have three mascots, so we can put in one more. But we also could play hearts. Which one would we rather have? Ah, we'll just do this. We'll just go level seven really quickly. And then we'll drop in drop in Sona. Plus another spell slinger. That would make the most sense in my head at least. Ooh, she actually one taps right now. But that's right now. Later on, she probably doesn't. So you probably want like three chalices for her. <laughs> Ionic probably pretty bad for her because she might not target the front line that often. It, it's random targeting. I'm pretty sure it literally says random. I'll double check for for science. Yeah, to a random enemy. It's not ideal at all. Do I want, um, who's a better mascot? Alistair would be perfect for our team. He gives us a mascot and Ox Force. Um, okay, and then we need some sort of mana regen. We just have civilian for now, but we could run Janna later on. Okay, and that doesn't seem so bad. Kind of test the mana. We gained three. I can't tell. We gained four. Civilian stops working after that point. Maybe it is um, rounded up. Or not rounded, like uh, you get the decimals for mana. I don't I don't know, man. Okay, so Echo probably pretty good because he's got a tank item on him. I'll take that. Because we definitely want him in. Um, do we want him in? Better than Rel, that's for sure. Yeah, you, you pretty much have to run Echo. If not, your tank lines just suck so much. Okay. Okay, maybe I stop focusing on the Lux. Go for a different carry now. And then just use her as my secondary carry. Okay, so we hit the Rel too. So mascot's pretty useless because um, I don't get the bonus thing. But it's okay. We have more, we have heart now. So. I'll add them back in later. So we're missing a spell slinger, so I want to throw in a Blanc later on. Oh, this guy's... Why does this guy have future sight? That's so, like... So gross, man, like... Not gonna lie, that is... And, and then she doesn't crit. Okay, so that's what I want on her. I want a crit item on her. So, next glove I'm getting for her. Probably building... Either Guard Breaker or Hand of Justice. One of the two. Yeah, that sounds, that sounds like a plan. And then when I level up, who do I put in? I want Alistair. Alistair plus Gallia. When 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 are we hitting level eight? Also, which prankster can be used? Do we even need prankster? We might not need prankster. That's tough, that's tough. Okay, so I'd replace Nyla with Kalia to give me spell slinger, that's for sure. Mm. Okay. 
It'll be a similar team comp to last time, but a little bit different. Just because we got so many Luxes. So it's pretty much we just don't need a secondary carry. I'll just focus on... Okay, just build the same items with her Talia now. Are there other spell slingers? And, um, LeBlanc. But I don't have many LeBlanc, so we'll just stay like this for now. Hmm. I should probably put these guys closer together because Nyla heals in a area around her. Oh wait, no, it just says allies. Is that everyone? It's everyone. Oh, spatula. Is there such thing as our guardian spat? There is not. I don't like any of these. I guess heart I can build. There's another echo, so I want that. And we're probably just gonna go level eight. Probably next turn. Um, like Titans or Giant Slayer. Bramble for sure. Everyone builds crit nowadays. Uh, I mean, Giant Slayer is good for wind streaking, but I think we beat this guy anyways. Ooh. He's all one start except for like two units, and one of them's uh, Ash and Vi no items, so we should theoretically win. Theoretically, that's a strong word. Okay, nice, we did. So, what do we? Wait, someone got knocked out already. It's stage four one. <laughs> Was he underground or something? Aim assist. For every three sigils fired by her ability, she fires an extra sigil at the lowest health enemy. That sounds pretty good. Gain Natalia Combat Star, she shields the three highest health allies for 60% of their max health. That sounds pretty good too, because I'm running her, and I want a copy of her. He restores 10 mana per second, and his abilities hits all enemies within one hex. That's the carry Alistair build. I mean, aim assist sounds pretty interesting, but I... I think I'm just going this, because I, I just want to play Italia. I need a clear room for her. Selling Nyla, right? I have two Echoes in. It's okay. Echo's a fine unit. He's a... Uh... Yeah, it's good enough. And then do I just build Giant Slayer? Bow is literally it's easy route or nothing. This could be Shojin. Oh, I got talent. Oh no. Please, someone kill this guy. I have a, I have a Bramble Vest against his crit items, but uh, he's going to kill everyone else beforehand. Oh my god, that's how my streak ends. Oh my god, my Echo's just running around like a idiot. Jesus. Okay, that's a positioning difference. Dang, okay. So I need to reposition a bit. That really sucks, because that's my that's my street. Okay, so who's my other heart right now? Not running any mascots. Not that I need to. I really want Alistair. Maybe I should roll a bit. I have a lot of pairs. Uh, do I even need... Do I have six Star Guardian? Oh, because I... Okay, let me put Nyla back in. I don't need this guy anymore. I probably don't need LeBlanc anymore. Because... I guess I don't need Annie anymore either. But whatever, we'll, we'll, we'll just do this. I, I need to roll more because I have, like, so many pairs still. I have, like, four pairs. Plus I want Talia. Oh, I could have kept Galio for, for Sins and stuff, but it, it's okay. It's okay. Um, how are you enjoying set 8 on live? Anything new you noticed different from PvE? Not so much yet. It's kind of the same. There were some changes, but it's not like anything that major. So it, whatever you're doing on PvE should be like pretty similar, at least, to what they're doing now. There's another Syndra could be used, but I want Tear or Rod for my Talia. Probably the Tear. Because I have uh, a lot of Star Guardian. 
I also want health. Because, uh, like the be the stone thing, it sounds pretty useful, right? I mean, yeah, that just sounds... Okay. I, I need, like, a warm augs then, but it's a little too late to plan around that. Hustling her hearts, build that, build this, drop this on her, maybe do this. That, that I don't get talent later on. Also, Lux targets randomly, so she could literally be anywhere. You don't need to position her exactly. Talia still likes the edge, but it's okay. Um, I could use one more. I could take out a heart. I'll take out a spell slinger. I feel like this is just better because, like, I have the Shojin now, so I should gain like a billion mana. We should gain too much mana. We're at three spell slingers, three hearts. So Sona's kind of just sitting there doing nothing, which is just fine, right? There's always some leech on some team. Maybe we could run a threat or something. They're supposed to be just like decent units. Ah, uh, you hit the training dummy. Ooh, I'm an idiot. Instead of itemizing Talia, I should have put the Shojin on Syndra. Because that would have been much, 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 much better. Okay, we probably want to roll on 8 a bit. Or we could go 9 so we could add in, like, actual synergies. Hmm, maybe I just want to drop... No. Hmm. I want more hearts for some reason. Does star level matter for Syndra ult? Let's check. He gets a bigger shield and damage amount. So I would say it does matter. Oh, this guy's got 46. I'll kill the LeBlanc, nice. Oh, I got zedded. Unless my Lux pulls some like magic strings. No, I don't have any healing. Why is my Annie all the way in the back? Oh, it's from Syndra, that's why. It's okay to lose a couple rounds, it's just fine, it's fine. Why does Corrupted matter? Because Corrupted, it like makes him, it makes Fiddlesticks AFK until he's 60% health or if your team dies, so it'd be kind of bad if it if it worked like that. So that's why they have it that way. Is a Talon guy still in the game? He is, so I still have to position like this. Um... So I can go for level 9 now, because we have a ton of gold. I, I could roll a bit, I guess, but like, seems like a free level 9. Oh, it's not happening anymore. That's fine. Uh, bow. I'm probably building a Titans. I could build Heart Emblem, so I'll grab the tier. That means I want to level up. I'll probably level up next turn. And who gets the heart? Does it matter? There's someone who casts often, so... Who has low mana? Yumi? Maybe Talia. Oh, you idiot. She's already a heart. I'll just put it on Talia, because she's not going to be my primary carry. And she has Shojin, so it, like she casts a lot. So you just want them to cast a lot so you get more AP. Then I will buy the Soraka. Can I replace any hearts? Mm, not really. So I want a Spell Slinger, so I'll just play Annie or Janna. Probably Janna. Okay, that heart thing really helped out a lot. And then we're at 28 lives, so we should have like a couple lives to play around with. Get 40 to level up. Beautiful. We hit one upgrade. Don't need these guys. Sure. Whoa. Don't mind if I do. I'll deal with 
by the extra talium. How do I still not have Yumi 2, by the way? Seems a little weird. Um, but I guess we could drop some Star Guardians now and just play, like... <laughs> random legendaries or something. Do we get loot? Any loots? Regal. Thank you, Riot Games. I really needed that three gold. Could have been, uh... Ah, <sighs> literally anything else. Is three gold the lowest drop, or can you get two? I, I don't know. Who's my other mascot? Oh, it's literally just Yumi, so that trait's kind of useless. Do I roll? I kind of want Janna... But, like, it's not gonna do... I don't know, it does something. I'll position. I'll position Sweat. I'll be a cringer. I want him right in front of that team. I probably want my Echo in front as well. Oh man, I'm pretty cringe. I'm actually scouting. Because Urgot, he, um, he just throws in a line in front of him. So you, you treat him like Shroud. Like, right now... If he didn't get Sejuani ulted, he would have hit like 10 people. Instead, he's just not going to cast this game like this. How long is he stunned for? Cast? I want items! He casts when the fight ends! He did zero magic damage. How long can you be stunned for? Like, is that even possible to be stunned for that long? I I want the Shoujin. It's not, right? Like, that's not possible. Because he was Sedg ulted like twice. So Sejuani got to ult twice. I think. I'm not actually sure. I just think. Goes on Syndra. I need some stuff for her to pull in, so. Here you get a shield. That's insane. Alright, let's scout again. This guy. And this guy. So I can't position around either of them because one of them has Talon, one of them has Zed. So. Against Talon, you want to be in the middle. Against Zed, since his in, is in the middle, you want to be on the edge. Instead, he's just going to attack my carries right away. Maybe we could get him. No, that would be too wishful thinking. I forgot didn't get Jack because I didn't position him because I was worried about everyone else. I have no CC for the Zed, apparently. He dodges my Lux's ability. Okay. The, the tanks got me, though. Okay, at least we get that. Man, this Urgot's really underwhelming, though. He's not giving me any items and stuff. Ooh, Yumi too. About time. Huh. These two units are probably fine. Because I want to make interest still. Uh, so we're facing this guy. He's all on the right. I put, should have put my Talia on the left, maybe? Actually, no. If she attacks in a line here, that's good. What's her targeting? Is it most units? Seems like it. Or is it her target? Because that could have been her target as well. Maybe it's her attack target. I have no clue, man. All I know is that my units are casting a lot. I don't have enough units on my bench. <laughs> that's funny. It's okay. Well, well, once we get our Econ back up, we can buy more and hopefully get, like, real units to throw in. We're also missing one spell. We we didn't get a single Urgot loot again. Like, normally when I played Urgot in the past, he's gotten me a lot of stuff. So I'm actually confused as to why he isn't getting me much right now. Uh, that's really weird. Okay, what item do we want here? Maybe a Syndra item? Because I feel like... 
With Shoujin and seven Star Guardian, she should just be like throwing everyone in, you know? By everyone, I, I mean everyone. Item. And a justice, maybe. Or redemption. Do I have tank item slots? Not really. I'll do a hand of justice. Who would it. get it? Probably Talia. Syndra did the most damage? No way. I think his Lux has crit, so it would help her out the most. But Syndra, if she's two starred. Okay, there's a Janna I've been wanting. I think I give it to her. Oh, I'm an idiot. Her damage isn't. Oh my god. Her damage is from the units being pulled in, not her actually doing the damage. Why did I put it on her? It's... I, I got tricked out by this stupid thing. At least I'm assuming that's what's happening. Well, she died this fight, so I can't tell. I would assume it's the units that she pulled in that did the damage. Whatever, it's it's fine. Isn't it just 20% chance? Uh, the Hand of Justice? I mean, 20% crit means a lot because... Um, once you have some crit, the more crit you get, it just makes it better. And because her ability can crit, it's just like doubly good. Uh, okay, Mordekaiser could be pretty good. I do want to play this Janna. I play it over Urgot because he's going to get pulled in anyways. We could do that. Maybe I don't need to group everyone. I sell this other Urgot. Yeah, so since Urgot's gonna get pulled in, we should be chilling. As long as my... T Man, every time I group up, I face the Sejuani. It's hilarious. At least I have two people on the side there. Maybe this guy scouted me. We got some loot. Ooh, we got an item. Good one. Might be a little too late. Okay, let's just roll down and get some random stuff to put in. So we'll put him up there. Put this guy here. We, we don't need to like min max this thing, right? I'd rather them just like tank more stuff. So maybe we sell these two and then buy them back. This one maybe, maybe whatever. And then once Urgot gets pulled in, I buy a unit. And she pulls in someone else. Buy another unit. We don't need to. <laughs> Alright, that's not bad. Oh, you're talking about Urgot loot rate. Um, 15% chance. I don't know what the base is. I could check after. Uh, probably want Ice Cream Cone. Or I could have taken Talia, go for Talia 3. That would have been fun, right? I wanted an AP item here, but it doesn't seem like they have that. Just drop this on. Lux is doing the most on Talion. Alright. Put it on. Actually, I'll drop it on Janna. We'll do this. There's a Sejuani. Whoops. Mispositioned. Ooh, Sejuani went the other way. See, I put that rel there just as like a, a hope that it would reposition the Sej, and it, it worked out. Holy cow. See, look, only two people got stunned instead of like 10 people. 
Pull in another unit. Pull in another unit. Beautiful. Oh, we might actually win this game. Hmm. Alright, let's roll down for this. Someone. I want to keep that Yumi for. Is it just random? random. Unlucky. Okay, Syndra, stop being stunned. Why are you stunned so long? She pulled the two worst units in. Or the three worst units. Okay, we still won, so I guess that's good. Wait, does this guy knock the other guy out? Holy cow, we just won the game. Dude, I kind of wanted to get Talia 3, but that's good enough. Okay, that was an AFK game. Not bad. I even forgot we had AFK, but I guess that's, that's kind of cool.